Hi there, this is Willie Felton at Seattle Academy. Um, I'm going to make an updated um, parent Schoology video here. Uh, this process has changed from the document that is on your site and from our previous videos, so I thought I'd give an update. So if you go to powerschool.com who owns Schoology, you'll see this page here. It's a little busy. Um, you do not want to go to parents and students, that's an FAQ. You want to go to login, even if you don't have a login. Now, parent and student logins. Now this is all of their products, so we only use Schoology, these others we don't want to deal with. Now, I think the best, unless you know you have a username and password and you've already tied it to your account, to your student's account, I would say you have to start with this register process. Um, once you do that, you will put in an access code, register, this, and you hit parent. This access code is on Veracross. It's on the parent portal under classes and reports. You'll see a document called Schoology access code, and that's the access code that will go there. Once you put that in, you'll need to register. Once you create a username and password, <clears throat> and just so you know that if you have an, a previous account with an email, you have to do some either a different email or you can just do a username. So you don't have to be, um, you don't have to use an email for the username. You just have to remember which one you're using. So um, if you, so once you do that, you'll see here's my fake account. There's my student right there and I can switch. And so sometimes people get confused because it looks blank here, but you have to go up here and select their courses. And this is where you can see the courses they're in. So there's all the courses they're in. You can click on see their calendar. If you look up here, this calendar is very helpful. You can see all of this. That's usually where people spend most of their time. Um, if you have a student with an account from a different school, you will have to make a new, you'll have to make a new user. Um, get you there. So hopefully that was helpful. It's a new updated video of how to access your Schoology, your kids' Schoology page from your parent account.